Hey, what's up, y'all? Pete here. It's Wednesday, August 31st. Just uh, about to go roll around Manchester, distribute the press release we came up with that uh, informs the cops and everyone else, the media that were here, that we uh, plan to seek accountability. I think uh, we'll be safer, uh, less risk of arrest and things like that, letting uh, those folks know that we're here. Obviously, they would prefer us not to be here, so if we can have a bigger footprint while we're here, the more likely we are to get justice and uh, accountability in our situation. So. Um, we'll see what happens. So I'll let you know I'm recording. But uh, I'd like to drop this off for uh, Greg Muller if I could. He has a box here or something. Thank you. Uh, my name is Pete Ayer. I'm, I'm also listed on there. Cool. Thank you. Okay. And what's your name for my records, please? Lisa. Lisa. What's your last name? I'm Lisa. I'm a legal assistant. Is it Lisa Galicia? Yeah. Okay. Well, I appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah. Howdy. Just want to let you know I'm going to record for my records. Um, I'd just like to leave this for the mayor, if I could. It's just oh, a press sorry. release and a couple business cards. Okay. All right. Thank you. And what's your name for my records? It's okay. Vicky Ferraro. Okay. Right there, so awesome. Thanks, Vicky. A little image of that as well. Perfect. All Thank right. You. Have a good day. Howdy. Just want to let you know I'm filming this for my records. Um, I like, if I could, I'd like to submit a. Uh, I'm sorry, no, no Get this dropped off in like the, in the chief's box and one in uh, Sergeant Patty's box. Uh, yes, ma'am. And, and what is it, sir? These are just press releases about uh, some activity, essentially. Uh, I was right, one. Let me give it to the supervisor. Okay. And I can also give you a couple business cards. Let me, I don't know if I can take them. Let me give it to the supervisor okay. and I'll show them. I, I didn't see oh, okay. them. Yeah, sure. Yeah, one, one dash one three four five eight. Okay. Uh, I'd just like to leave one for the chief and one for Sergeant Patty, if I could. I don't know if they'll make it to them or uh, see if we can put them in the mailboxes. And yeah, if they have mailboxes, I can also leave business. What's the purpose of these? Well, the press releases, essentially my friend and I were a couple of folks arrested back in June 4th. I get all that, yeah. And uh, we just want to, we plan to um, draw attention to the situation and uh, ultimately get our charges dismissed because okay. um, we didn't do anything wrong. So. Okay. Okay. Uh, thank you very much for your time, sir. Yep. And I'm going to solicit stuff. Uh, all content related to uh, arrests that happened on June 4th, eight people arrested, complaints levied against particular officers, um, incidents where officers sustained injuries, incidents when they discharged firearms, uh, an individual slain by uh, Manchester PD officers, any prior arrests for chalking. Okay, I'll wait, thanks. Um, the captain's gone for the day. Okay. He has the forms. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I have some coins too. We'll get the form. Yeah, I'm going to record this for my records. My name is Pete Ayer. Hey, Pete. Lieutenant Susie. Susie, good to see you. Yeah, I mean, I have a, a lot of things going on today. Um, one, I just wanted to, I shared a press release with your colleagues, let them know we're back in town. My colleague and I were two of the eight arrested in early June outside the police department for chalking. And um, at that incident, Cameras, as you may know, were, and, and phones were taken from another number of folks there, and um, receipts were not issued. And some of the property was later returned, but they claimed to have never taken a cell phone from my person. And I, that cell phone was, in fact, taken from me when I was being processed. I don't know if you guys have video uh, from the processing area from that date that I could obtain. I mean, I have questions about how I can go about obtaining more information about the department, complaints against certain officers. That have been filed. I can't help you with that. Do you, can you explain to me the process on how to get that information? What information are you looking for? Um, like number of complaints filed against officers, if they were sustained or not. Um, no. At the end of the day, you guys purport to work for us, and sure. transparency is pretty important. Sure. So I would hope that um, legitimate complaints would be uh, acted upon. And uh, you're welcome to contact uh, Captain Coney of the legal division. Mm -hmm. Okay. I, I can't help you. There's nothing I can do right now. 
can you uh, share with me policies of the department, things like that? Arrest procedures? No. Is that accessible anywhere to the public? Pardon? Is that accessible to the public anywhere? Our policies and procedures? No. Really? All right, yes. I guess that's all I have right now, then. Okay. All right. Making sure no one else has the rights violated here by folks who are in badges. It seems to be common practice around here. Maybe I'm not saying you yourself, but... Not with you, because you've already got an attitude against me. I'll wait for the next officer. Hey, uh, my name is Pete Ayer. I want to let you know I'm recording this call for my records. I was one of the eight arrested on June 4th outside the police department. Uh, for more information on that, you can check out copblock.org slash chalk. Um, the reason for my call, I stopped by the police department today. I inquired uh, a few things, and uh, I spoke with Mr. Saucy and, uh, to address a couple of my um, issues. He recommended that I get in touch with uh, Robert Cunha, so... Um, I want to leave a message and encourage him to call me back. My number. Yes, sir. Howdy. Uh, I don't know if you remember. We spoke yesterday. Um, I'm recording again for my records. Okay. Uh, I was wondering if uh, I could get that form that we uh, talked what about. What we're going to do is, what we're going to have you do is use your regular report request form. Okay. But on the back side, is fill in what you, as specific as possible, what you're looking for right. as far as like date uh, ranges well, and things like that. Okay. And then I'll give it to the supervisor to go to the city solicitor and they'll determine what can, we can release and what can't be released. Okay, and would you suggest if I want... Howdy. Yeah, just want to let you know I'm recording for my records. And can I ask what your name is for my record? Kim? Okay, um, yeah, I was uh, wondering if Robert Kuna is available. He's gone to court. All right, and he would be the best person to talk to about it property that had been taken during processing that wasn't like inventoried properly and and later was not found okay okay all right thanks and i just came back to marv and it looks like we got a love note well i can't i you know we're it, we're not here to argue your case because we don't know i'm back I'll be back a lot till we get our charges dropped. Well, I would hope you would make time because this affects my standard of living. I, I okay, plan we, to be in the Manchester area, I and I don't feel that applies okay, to my I situation. Listen, I explained. And I don't want to be further harassed by folks okay, with badges. We are done with this conversation. 